There we go. What's up, everybody? Come on. Come again. There we go. Hello, there is a kitty, there is an ISO. Let's make sure we have everything up here. Okay. Nope. Do not. Hold on. There you go. <clears throat> Hmm. No. I'm gonna be honest because it takes me a while to get into this outfit. Because it was like one size too small. on you? It shouldn't be like you're fucking little. Anyway. <clears throat> I'm kind of burned out on it. I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. I saw it and I'm like... Yeah, no. <laughs> no. I don't know. Maybe. Like, since I played World vs. World for so long, and then I just. I don't know. Like, part of me wants to go back into it, but then I'm like, if I do that, that's taking me down that rabbit hole. I just got out of that rabbit hole. <laughs> oh, right here. Hold on. I'll show you why I don't wear this one often enough. It is. It really is. And since I've been doing it for a couple of months at this point, I'm just like, yeah. Sources. I have to put safety pins here. You can kind of see it. There's one right there. And there's one that's down here. <laughs> that's why. That's that's why I don't wear this often. It takes a while to uh, put this on. Also, I actually have right above the the camera, the main one that I always have. You see this right here on the uh, this little watermark thing trying to raise donations enough to get that off also we can do 4k you want this in 4k <laughs> that's that's the whole entire point of that anyway <clears throat> um this guy scale skin in the training post I don't know let's see Oh yeah, this thing. It's actually kind of cute. I'm not gonna lie, it's actually pretty cute. Give me a second. There is a bottom. Oh, thank God. 
I had a tail. Oh, that's adorable. No, that's actually really cute. I like, I like this. The little... They wiggle. They wiggle! Alright, anyway. Ah, but yeah, no, I'm just... I do read the updates that they put out for the World vs. World rebalancing thing, and clearly the Alliance thing is changing from what they originally had said. And so I'm just like, I think a lot of people kind of figured that shit out already. I need to see, I still need to do Convergence. I keep missing it. At first I thought I knew what it was. Oh boy, I was wrong. It's an actual instance that you have to go into. I, I thought it was the thing that was going on right now. Where you take things here, you escort them up and everything. I thought that was the convergence. I was so not right. The convergence is like 17 minutes or something like that. So yeah. I need to figure out how we get into this. Because I need to do this. So that is like the one of the things that I want to do. Tower courtyard waypoints. Okay, not even in this map. Okay. Let's look this up. Group instance during night supporting up to 50 players. Requires the expansion, blah blah blah. <sighs> Public instance, that's what we're aiming for. Oh, I think I know. It's that one that's like, it's like second floor or something like that. Oh, okay. Oh crap! That was the thing. I was okay. So. Turns out that, not turns out, um, so tomorrow is going to be the first video of several for a new YouTube series. I, I've got some things, I am literally just going to take a written guide that I have, we're doing Verdant Brink, um, but it's a written guide that I'm going to turn into a five minute video. And it's basically, it's Guild Wars 2, how to meta, and then the name of the map. So that is going to be launching tomorrow. I, that might change over time. I don't know if this is the convergence thing, right? Yeah. So... Kind of starting to have doubts that I should have done started off with, excuse me, with um, Verdant Brink, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Mostly because that's a high, one of the highest viewed guides that I have written for meta maps. For those of you who don't know what Verdant Brink is, I'm not gonna go there right now because I'm here. It is this map right here. Um, I did this for a stream for a couple of days actually. This is like taking 3D chess to a whole entire new level and I'm gonna be honest, this guy took me a while to make. Got the five zones, you've got the six bosses up in the rooftop basically. Um, I'm going to basically just do a brief overview of this the map, you get your zones. Um, the waypoints that I, or the waypoint slash camps that I feel that you should definitely focus on because you literally just teleport there and you can go up. So, very little, little movement involved. 
This is the one that's the hardest one because not a lot of people go for those shrouded ruins. It's also really hard to keep control of, but I would rather have this one instead of one of these over here because this one, as long as you have this, it's like literally right there. Up you go. It takes you to the Patriarch. Obviously the main one that's in here is this one. A lot of people keep this one because the Matriarch, which is the one that a lot of people park their alts at, is there. Um, this one I think is the Dual Frogs. This one, Noble Ledges. The, um, this one is... The Axe Master? I think it's the Axe Master. This one is the guy with the sky scales. And then there's another one that I don't remember right off the top of my head of where you access that one from. I think it's also from up here, which is the um, the trio. But anyway. So yeah, I've been debating about how to do that one. It might not happen Saturday. Um, it might come out Sunday, depending on if I can find an active map when I actually get around to recording that, because I have not done that. And as you know, when you're on NA, sometimes things drift off. <laughs> That's a lot of people here. I've been trying to do my best to remind myself to log in and at least do my home instance. It's so hard at times to remember. Ooh! 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 I actually did this earlier this week. I got my second legendary piece on my light character. So I've got four more pieces to go before I have that set done. So that's exciting. Anyway. How much of these other ones do I have? Take these out. Take these two. Let's keep this down. We're at it. People are going crazy here. Oh, I don't remember how many of these I have. Um, it's a trophy bag. Like this one. I got I have extra avocados now says no one ever he can never have extra avocados it's not there it's over here
this. This is my first time doing this. It's gonna be fun. It's like World vs. World Reset Night. I mean, that is tonight, but... Thank you! I have no idea. I'm assuming that this is something that we did in the story, just like a revisitation or a reimagination, but... I have no idea. Is it? Oh shit. <laughs> okay. The only reason why is because of the wizard's vault. Collect 500 cryptus essence during the convergence and then defeat a legendary cryptus during convergence. And I'm like, alright. You help Zojo with something? Alright. I did a brief read. I mean, I think we're going to have a decent amount of people here. I could be wrong. This, this may not be everybody that gets in. I don't know. They look very eager to get in, though. Oh, excuse me. Hard swimming amongst mere minnows. Oh my god. You got the moth. Ooh. Oh hell, that is amazing. Yeah, no, those are pretty. That's very pretty. He looks, he looks, he looks very, very, I want to say powdery. I mean, if you know, you know. Yeah. <clears throat> I remember at um, the last job that I had, since I worked at nights, um, I enjoyed going over to the east wing. I was the emergency room was the west wing, but um, the east wing, the east wing was where the specialty people worked at, and they were closed during the night because you know normal people hours. So yeah, so whenever we had to go over to the east wing to either get um, our laundry done because that's where the, the facilities were for the laundry for the, the animals and everything or restocking 
was over in the East Wing as well. Well, kind of on the, it's like on the way to the East Wing. It was a big ass fucking facility, mind you. But, um, we would see Luna Mods stuck to the, stuck to the windows because there was gentle light coming in because I mean, during the East Wing, you shut all, most of the lights down. So. I miss that place. That was really fun, that place. You have a total of like 10 people there at night. And a bunch of animals that are dying, but you know, you're, you're doing your best to keep them alive. But yeah, no, they're, they're, they're pretty. They're very pretty. Those look like things from the Realm of Torments in Guild Wars 1. Holy shit. Especially this thing. Gizzy, gizzy, gizzy. Someone says to don't vote. Oh. <laughs> I'll click the vote thing towards the end. Yeah, I mean, I, I understand that part. I have no idea what I'm doing. I don't know, people are standing here, so we'll just... Like, first time here, what we do? Kill shit on a bus. <laughs> I can do that. I can do that. It says grab balls. I don't... Um, I feel like this is... do this.
assuming that the orbs are up in the in the, in the air in the sky. Rob's drop window. Oh. Looks like Zoja picks up fallen allies, so that's good. Oh, that looks badass. I have no demonic essence. I guess I'm not killing things? I'm not tagging things? I don't know. Oh shit. Oh shit. You are, but when mobs die, you splash out so you have to run over them and deliver. Oh. Do they disappear after a while? Gotcha. So it says I have to find a discharge unit. I'm not quite sure what that is. I'm assuming that Zoja is not a discharge unit. If I have any, but we're gonna go find out. Tell me if I've done any of these. Well, apparently, I have done 20. <laughs> I'm doing something. I see them, I see them, okay. I thought that was part of something else. Oh, okay, okay, nope, I got it, I got it, I got it. Oh, yeah, they do. Oh, okay. I don't have to do anything. I just have to pick him up, come to the circle. Okay. Now that everybody has kind of dispersed from the center. Makes sense. Oh, kitty, thanks for the cheers. I am not singing. You know for a fact I can't sing. I 
How's that map? Shit, okay. Oh no, what do I get the little things and deposit them? Let's go deposit, go deposit. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Alright, so. Over here. I have to go after the champion, right? Yeah, no. There's nobody else over there. Right, let's go. Let's go to the commander tag. Where's the commander tag? I've lost him. Oh, I see, I see, I see, okay. There's a lot of these over here. Quick, 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 go, go, go. Quick, go deposit them, go deposit them. Okay, okay. I'm on fire. <laughs> Champion is over here. No, 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 no. I'm actually going to go deposit this over here. I'm assuming that you take those things and deliver it to the trebuchet things. I'm assuming that's what that is. Because I saw that they had gone and delivered something or they went to the trebuchet. This thing's kind of hurt. Ah, da, da, da. No. I'm up. <laughs> neener, neener. As you gain these things, you um, your that bar increases. I'm assuming you don't want that. Jesus. 88. Okay. Okay. I think you actually get more when you do the boss things. Oh, okay. Destroy this. Oh, shit. Ok. 
Okay, okay. As you okay, so that that that's that's making sense. That mechanic is making a lot of sense. And this is Oja's bar. That's essence for resurrection spell. So you need to delete. You need to max that out in order to gain. Oh. Okay. 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 Huh, that's a mushroom. So, as you deliver those essences, you're getting that bar up. It tells you how many people you have. So, we have 50 in this instance. The faster you get the essence in there, the faster you get people who were down back up. Let's get my hits on this guy. Oh shit, there's an- oh, there's another one! Ooh, it's a skateboarding one. Actually, pretty easy to understand. So, yeah, no, like it, it seemed a little overwhelming at first, but no, nah, this is. If you've been doing any of the other metas elsewhere, this this actually makes a lot of fucking sense. Zoja's not here anymore. Okay.
Oh no, she has moved. Or maybe not? Where's Ojo? Zoja's taking damage. Oh, I see. No, Zoja's over here. Oh my gosh, she moved again! God damn it, Zoja. This is why I still don't like you. So like two to three runs and you have that done. Depending. Oh, that's a lot of them down. I'm so happy that you can actually like zoom out during things like this. Whoa. Oh, no, 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 not today. Not today.
There's no timer on this. Yeah, no, it's, that was the thing I was starting to wonder, I'm like, is there a timer for this? Because there's other maps that have timers, although this is an instance, but I mean, still. Yeah, which is nice, which is nice. actually kind of fun. First time through, might have been a little rough at the start because I'm like, I mean, yeah, you just kill things, but I didn't know that you could, um, like how, yeah, no. Once you, I'm gonna be honest, once you space out a little bit from, from the enemies, Can, or in, and from your teammates, you can kind of see things a little bit better. So that initial group zerg is a little much. But no, no, like you see things afterwards. That's not bad. That's actually really easy. Oh, hey, mastery point. <laughs> Two hundred percent participation. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, that was. Oh. Holy crap. Okay, so we're going to be visiting this at the end of the night. Okay. <laughs> says there's something... Oh, am I... Yeah, no, it's actually really well done. Also, like the amount that you need in something like that, that's, you need a lot of people for that. So convergence is every three hours, correct? 
Yeah. Okay. Not bad. I mean, still look at the map and I saw those things. And I was like, mm. still not quite sure what those zones are. You go there, you fight some champions, you have to go do something with a, a trebuchet. You kill the champion, go back to Zoja, deposit stuff, go to trebuchet. I'm not quite sure what to do to the trebuchet because I did not make that. But. Hey. <laughs> okay. I did read that. If she dies, fail. <laughs> okay, so today we had that fun. <laughs> yeah, I think I was working on this one a little- I don't know. Ooh, actually no, it's this one I wanted to do, to get the tier 3 Cryptus Rifts. Okay. Correct. Mm-hmm. You know exactly what you're gonna say. Because some of those, some of those uh, things in there are riding horses. What did you link though? Oh yeah. I mean, there's there's been some theories. There's been some theories. Um. I mean, as you've not, if you don't know at this point in time, um, like, I don't know if this is going to be exactly a spoiler alert, but, like, I know that humans are not from this plane of existence, basically. Makes me wonder if some other things that may or may not have been here. Makes you kind of wonder. I wish we had a little bit more of that universe, though. I'm not gonna lie. Um, because... Oh, what was it? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. <clears throat> okay, th yeah, it's the same thing. Okay, horses are four-legged equines, which are presently not seen in the accessible regions of Tyrio. They have been historically used by humans as mounts and beasts of burden, and are well known by many humans and other central Tyrian races. The earliest known records of horses show that they existed on Cantha during the reign of Emperor Kaining Ta. According to Loremaster Ermrind, the Emperor was renowned for his horseback riding, but died under mysterious circumstances while hunting in 464 BE, with reports claiming that his horse had gone wild and killed him. Oh, you actually triggered the raid thing? Thank you, Esteban! <laughs> water is back on. Wait, you lost water? You had water issues? <laughs> Alright, so going back to the horses and why they don't exist in here. Okay. Um, as humanity expanded, this is kind of like pre this game. Oh, okay. That's good. Go shower, you stink. Okay. <laughs> the earliest known records of horses show that they. Uh, wait. As humanity expanded to Or and Kreita, they used horses for various tasks in their new colonies as well, though it is unclear whether they brought horses with them or if horses were native in other lands. Both Orians and Kreitans were known to have horses for riding as well, both in military and leisure. Used in the case of the latter. Mad King Thorn is known to have had many horsemen under his command in life and undeath. It is unclear whether Ascalonians or Elonians ever had horses in their nations. However, 
They have made occasional references to them, so it is clear they knew horses at the very least. Similarly, Elonians have in the past enslaved centaurs to work them in the same manner as they have worked horses. So, with that said, if you've ever played Gilmer's 1, you some of the dialogue that you come across with some NPCs, they talk about it. They mention it. Um, if I remember correctly, there's a couple of places where you actually see, like, depict depictions of, or depictions of, not depictures, what the fuck, depictions of horses or something that resembled a horse, but you'd never see them. <clears throat> also in here, I mean, maybe not so much in this one, but, um, in uh, Mad King Thorn. And I think, um, I mean, you also see some, like, as we said with the thing, um, the ones that we just got done fighting in the Convergences, you see people on horseback. That's very much a horse. Realm of Torment and Guild Wars 1, I'm pretty sure, also had things that look like horses. Anyway. Um, 1319 AE, Kate, Logan, Thacker, and Rootlock Remstone used an old Asura gate to flee from destroyers and dwarven ruins. While calibrating the gate to take them to a safe location, they saw glimpses of other Tyrian regions. Including, and I remember seeing this. Ooh, I got goosebumps. I remember seeing this one. Including a grassy plain with what they identified as wild horses. You actually see them. That's, um, you're in the Old Asura Underground and you guys, um, activate that gate. You have to come around and you see it and then, like, you have to defend while, you know, she's trying to act, while they're trying to be activating that gate. And if you look at it, you see them. I don't know if they fixed that because, oh no, you know, lore breakage, but you see that. You really do. Um, as, as recently as 1325 AE, Crichtons may have used equines to pull carts and carriages in Queensdale. So there's that. I don't remember which... Old Asura Gates in Dwarven Ruins. Just two. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. I'm trying to remember the name of that one. I don't remember the name of that one. Okay, this is good. Yeah, this is Skill Burst 2. Um, it might have been during uh, Living World Season 3. If I remember correctly, because that's when you have to do a lot of stuff with with Kaith, Ritlock, and other stuff. Or it might have been actually in Path of Fire. It's either Season 3 or Path of Fire that you encounter those, if I remember correctly. Anyway. Um, blah, blah, blah. So the, the horseshoe that you posted, they have that. Um, the horse racer is in there. The mini lunar horse. Um, Mr. Gumdrops, which, oh, where is that one? Yeah, he's Mad King. Mr. Gumdrop, yeah, yeah no, that's a horse. Um, that's very Mad King Thorn stuff. And then original Guild Wars was a handful of zombie and ghost horses, hands down, you see them, especially in the Black Tide, I think. Um, ambient dialogue about centaurs and divinities range, you put them as in horses of variety who wants a pet that talks back. So 
stuff like that. Just no, man. There's there's horses. There's horses. The rocking horse ornament, a horse figure, zodiac axe skin, the bent horseshoe, the thunder horse staff skin, the dreamer. I have the finisher, the pony finisher. So we just don't see them. Why? I don't know. I really don't know. Like they're just they're just gone. Mm -hmm. But they fixed it. They fixed it because I remember that that went crazy with the community. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> I don't know. Maybe, maybe it's just a species that went extinct. I don't know. I mean, that could be very much so. I mean... Now I'm wondering, okay, so it was, well, let me get this one, okay. Was it this one? No, there's... It's in one of these things where you're with those three... Like, I remember that one so much because you, you're panicking, you're trying to get out, and then, like, seriously, just watch watch the, the images. <clears throat> yeah, I think it's in season three because I'm pretty sure it's not in here. Especially since I had to uh, take Vic's account through this so that I can do that, um, that guide for this, the... No. Yeah, for the griffin. Or the Sky Scout, I don't remember. No, it's a Griffin. It's a Griffin. So yeah, it's somewhere in season three. I'm gonna say it's probably flashpoints or rising flames. Alright, so we did that. Um, we're gonna be... Did a little bit of masteries and working on that one, so... In order to level this up, I need to do that. But at the same time, I have 16 points in that that I need to spend. I still need to go work on these things, and I'm just like, oh god. And I need to get enough to purchase that Mastery Crystal Dragon, which I don't think I have enough for. We're going to check real quick. Like taking measurements here. So I think it's I might be wrong, it might not be him. No, oh, it is this one.
Oh. All right, so we... Reigns of Power, so what is this one? Defeating a dragon champion in her dragon response mission grants additional materials while under the effect of the dragon boon of two elder dragons. Probably not going to do that one because I don't really do the dragon response mission. Um, while wielding multiple dragon essences, activating your elite skill now grants might, fury, and stability. You can now purchase recipes for superior dragon slayer weapon. Ah, oh, god damn it. There it is. Okay. <laughs> <clears throat> now I'm probably gonna just finish that one off and then just slowly work on this one but at least it has something that can gain the experience so uh, I'm not feeling the ice brood socket today though I know dragons what do we have so I got the jade bots highly recommend if you're wanting to do this get your jade bots Arborstone revitalization. I just finished that. Um, I'm actually going to focus probably between the turtle mount and I don't know, probably just the turtle mount because skiff piloting and fishing. I'm just mm. oh, that's actually pretty. Old. That sinks enemies swimming close to your skiff. But anyway, now we're going to be doing the turtle mounts, getting those things done. I mean, I have enough points for that, so and then these are just going to be a slow, a slow crawl. So I might work on that one actually. Um, I think I'm actually going to finish this one up because, first of all, you only need two for that. Um, but at least I will be able to find tier three cryptus rips. So. It's kind of an important thing, in my opinion. I don't know what that was. Okay. Oh! We have 89, 101, 61. Um, let's do this one since, you know, there's a tier 3 rift. So, I haven't unlocked that ability of finding them on my own yet. Buck skin. Alright, these we can sell. This one we're gonna salvage. Okay. So let's sell these real quick. Can I sell avocados? No, I can't. So God damn it. Oh yeah, I finally got the prototype position rewinder. I was trying to get it to work in um, Internaios. I don't know how people are doing it. They do it. I've seen them, but I don't know exactly what I'm doing wrong. Alright, that should be is done. Heading over to the outages. So we got that done. I'm so upset that you can't access things from your first accounts. Come on, it would have been so epic.
Do you exchange stuff for that? You do? Oh my god, wait a minute. Hmm. I always wondered what to do with this stuff since I just constantly just keep gathering it more and more. I have one in my home instance, so. <clears throat> Bootleg VIP pass. What the fuck? Okay. Alright. So we're gonna go work a little bit on end of dragon stuff. What do we have? The gang war is coming up, so we might hit that one. Let's do that. Oh, I need to see what else was in the um the wizard's vault. I wonder, okay, I haven't done these things in a while. Participates in an activity. We can do that. Um, salvage 50 items. I'm not really working on that one. Complete the specs laboratory. Ooh, where's that? Oh, God, it's that one. Do I have time to do this? Ooh, I might have time to do this. So this one is like up here. Here. Um, look for a small waterfall in the cliff to west. The entrance is a cave immediately south of the waterfall marked by pink trumpet shaped flowers. Head into the cave and climb up the rocks to access the puzzle. I've got like seven minutes. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. I don't know if I can get it, but we'll find out. Remember correctly, this is the one that's got a bunch of like golems and stuff that fight you. Okay, there's the waterfall. Oh, it's up. It's back there. Well, there's multiple waterfalls here. There it is.
Oh, sh oh, whoa, what happened? Whoa! What the hell happened? Shit just disappeared on me. And then it like reappeared. Oh, whoa! What the fuck? I know you're supposed to go over there. Now I remember. Got it. Uh, I gotta do something, I don't remember. It's this over here. There we go. Right, maybe we still have enough time to get into a map? I got time. Nice. Oh, I made it just in time. Is there anybody doing this? Is there... yes. Fun. I don't remember much about this one. I know that you have to... You have to control multiple... Villages? Like, you have to go to different villages, the ones on the red circles on the map. In the end, you're going... You're going here. 
and you go sh I don't remember which way I think it's this way. I don't remember much about this one. Uh, sucks. Yeah. That's pretty much the TLDR of this one, but you have to do stuff in order to get to that point. I haven't made a guide on this yet, so... That's my own fault. Nice! It's this one. <laughs> we're, all, we're getting that ready. I am taking measurements of my desk. This is sixty-five and a half minus make sure we take proper measurements. Sir, oh, yeah. I am currently rethinking how to have this as a layout. No, Kitty, I can understand if that was on your phone, but that is, that is not your phone account. I now officially have a lot of questions. So, yeah, no, I, um, I want to turn this into, like, an L-shaped desk thing. So I want to keep, like, the drawers here, this part here, 
this is going to be extended over to the wall so that I have an easier way of getting to the desktop because the desktop is down here. Every single time that I have to do anything on this, like a, like plugging into the back, I have to pull this thing out. The cable's already pretty short. I always worry that when I put it back that something's going to come loose. That's like my only issue with what my current setup is. Also, ugh. That also I can have, like, I want a place for my sewing machine. I'm gonna be honest. One that I don't have to worry about having to pull it out, do stuff, put it away. Now, it's one of the things I wanted to do this year was to save up enough money to get that. But I still need to figure out what kind of layout I'm going to do. That way, this all becomes like a huge bench. Oh, you can't see it. Hold on. This right here. This is a separated thing. I want this to be a solid thing. That way I can also have a storage underneath it so I can access the desktop easily for cables. Um, a couple of other things. Put the fabric under there, put the patterns under there. Also, I would have a place to do larger sewing projects instead of using the floor. And going goblin mode, you know? So that's one thing I wanted to do this year was that, right? Another one is I want to start the garden on top, but we still need to have access to that. That's an expense. That is super expensive project. Um, couple of other things, but no, I mean, first thing is first. Is, a, is upgrading parts of the street. That's the first thing. My first two current uh, targets I want to do is, um, like as I said before, right up above here, I want to have a permanent unlock for the droid cam so that we can do other things. Like I can take the camera and I can go somewhere else. Um, with it and show you stuff like if it's not always it's not always going to be mounted up here um like project wise but there's a there's a it's not super invasive watermark but until i can pay for that upgrade that's it I'll take you somewhere where do you want to go <laughs> but yeah so there's that. Um, and then the other one that I want to do after that is met is to get the full access to Touch Portal, which is about the same price. Oh, that that's totally messed up. That bedroom is a mess. Oh, I already have it.
plato. Gato was like, give me love. Meow. Right, meow. Speaking of, um, well, not exactly, but um, just talking to you reminded me, we actually are making chili con carne tonight. It has been sitting in the crock pot cooking for about five hours, almost five hours. What, chili con carne? Oh, yeah. That's pretty good. We have like two thirds of a Serrano in there, so. It's gonna be spicy. Whee! Oh, God. I can't get away. Oh, my God. <laughs> no. I don't know, Keto was actually really good when we had company over for uh, the holidays. I was afraid that she was gonna get... She was gonna get really stupid with, with people, but no. Like, I mean, she does, like, the things that I want her to do, which is, you know, be hesitant about, you know, strangers. But after a while, she realized that they weren't going anywhere, and she was like, okay, give me attention. <laughs> share food, share dog, share, <laughs> share pet, share boyfriend. All of the things. So we're actually doing pretty even distribution on damage here. Let's swap this in. Speaking of... So I'm working on... Working on the next written guide for this game, which is... Um, Dragonfall. I actually tagged up for that. This was like a couple of days ago. 
Um, it was probably like... Minimum would have been like two hours from now, right? Holy shit. Not everybody knows that meta. Or they just weren't paying attention. We almost failed that. We almost failed Dragonfall. Um, we got all of the, the camps up and everything and we triggered it. Um, we had to go and do the, um, the, not the ley line captures. The ley, the ley line mirrors? Ley reflectors, ley mirrors, whatever the hell it was, but anyway. Um... So we had that done, and that we had enough bodies, but what ended up happening was we we had people covering the pylons, we had people covering the, um, the, the weak points. It was the champions. That's where we failed it three times. We were about to fail the fourth one. And trying to tell people, like, in squad, in map, can't do team, and local, and it's like, we were able to get two out of the three down, and then by the time that people went to the third one, one of the other ones got back up. Rinse and repeat. We did that four times. The fourth one being successful, but... I was so close to tagging down and being like, alright, apparently people don't want to do this. I never been in a map where it got that close to failing. We had two minutes left. I remember after I got that done, I went and I like raged at, at Vic because it's like, I don't know why people can't read any of these places that, that like you need to, you need to get all three of them down within 30 seconds. Like there is no... And then there would be people... There would be people that were just hopping around, and I understand that they were trying to mean well, right? You know, hopping around from the champions to help, but I think that was actually doing way more damage than they think they were doing. Or something, I don't, I don't know. Super frustrating. But I am really hoping that with my guides, when I post them, that people are looking at them, they're, you know, telling people, <coughs> like, hey, you know, there's this. Also, when I start the YouTube series for doing the meta discussions, you know, just kind of explaining how to do them. Just, I really like this game. I like the community overall that has formed from this game. And I just, I just want to help. That's all I want to do is I just want to help.
And I know that especially when it comes to these things, like metas, I know that there's like barely any written guides. YouTube vids? Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Oh shit, did not make that. YouTube vids is probably some. I'm not quite sure. There's YouTube vids for everything, but I wouldn't doubt it. Yes. But the reason why I do my own is because if... <sighs> Here, we'll actually go, we'll, we'll bring this up. Um, let's do... <sighs> Octavane. Actually, I, no, wait, let's do Verdant Brink, because that's the one I'm making the, the, the thing of. Alright, so Verdant Brink. Starts off with this one. You have to do these. Right, this is no, you have to do day. You have to secure Verdant Brink first, right? So you do that. This is the reason why I want to do this, right? So you do that. Then you need to do the next part, which you have to find this. And it's just it's it's pages after pages, and I just want to have it all in one shot. That's it. Just all in one shot. Start from the top, go all the way down. Not having to do this, and then go and look at stuff, and then click on things, and like... Here, I'll show you. Hold on. Oh, I know Verdant Brink is special, trust me. <laughs> Let's see here. Verdant Brink. Exactly. So, here. So this is mine, right? This is the one that I wrote. And what it does is that it tells you, like, this is the quick TLDR. Um, I highly recommend that you have a mount of some type. Um, I would also highly recommend that you have at least gliding unlocked. And possibly, if you have a little bit more that you can dump into, maybe some bouncing mushrooms. I don't know. Hold on, I gotta move out of here. Hold on. I just realized that things spawned there. Okay. So there's that. Um, I go over this. Like, there's usually an order that a lot of people do. The matriarch, that's where everybody parks their character. The patriarch, which is the one that people go to afterwards. Um, frogs, axe master, and the triad. Usually the triad is the last one that people go to because I think it might be the hardest one after the matriarch. I don't know. And then you've got this. I got the different zones marked out. You got the red zone, the green zone, purple, blue, and white. And then I go over each section. This is these things. Like that way you look at this and you figure it out and you're just like, yes. You just have to reference one page to get the TLDR of everything. This is doing the day cycle, right? That's that's what these are. And also this is like the best place. So in total, you can actually have 20 places unlocked which you can see here. Each one of these is a place that you can have unlocked as a waypoint. Um, and then after doing, oh God, I was in this for like two to three weeks of doing this. I figured out the best ones that you should try to hold on to just for a quick response that you map there, you take the waypoint there, you go immediately up into the, into the, the treetops. Like this was, this was a labor of love, seriously. So that's that. Um, so there's that. And then this is what everybody comes to, which is the night cycle, which is the legendary and the champions. And these are where they're at. Um, how to deal with each one, like a quick, just general fight thing. And that's it. That's all I do. That's all that these guides are about. 
if you want to do this one, you have to do Securing Vert and Brink, which it goes over these, which I, I mentioned these. But if you want to do the knights and the enemy, like what happens after that, then you have to scroll down and you have to go look for this. And then there's this stuff. So it's just, the wiki in my opinion is great for like general referencing, but it's really not, you. it is user friendly, but at the same time it could be better, which that's what I'm trying to do. So also it's a lot of reading. Like, I understand, that's why I'm like, I just try to make it quick, concise, easy with pictures. Because people like pictures. I like pictures. So. And then, that's why I'm also wanting to do a YouTube series about it. <laughs> it's just, I just want to help people. I just want to help people so much. When it goes to the whole entire like night and day thing, um, I mean, even on the most inactive maps, packed command waypoint, which is the one that's in the center, is usually the one that people make sure that there is available because that's where the matriarch thing is. That's where a lot of people park their alts. Um, but everything else people could really care less about. But in the end, there's still people who actually do want to do the meta, and honestly, it's kind of rough. It's it's kind of rough if you're doing it by yourself, which, as I had found out. Um, especially on that south part. The, um... This part. Or the... this one. <clears throat> because the best one to get, I know a lot of people, they want to... I know it's an MMO, but like, during the times that I play, since I'm like, in a... I know that, you know, 3 o'clock in the morning, there's not a lot of people like you would have during, you know, like, prime in a prime time, which is like 9 p.m., not 3 a.m., but anyway. But a lot of people would try to keep these camps unlocked but I found out that this one here which is the third one is actually the best one because if you keep these if you want to go to one of these things you have to teleport here and then you have to fly or run over here well if you had this one which is the third part of the third station or third option however you want to put it you just literally go here and then go up like it's so easy and then trying to tell people or explain to people about this it, it was it was a bit it was a bit and then eventually people were just like oh because they saw what i was trying to convey so <clears throat> but then you still have the people who are stubborn and they're just like no you just need to have the one and it's like all right anywho It's my little, my little rant. Not exactly a rant, I just, I just, I just want to help people, that's all I want to do is I just want to help the community, make the game enjoyable, easy to do, especially for people who either haven't done that in a long ass time, or be never did it before. That's so that. Yeah, we sell these three things. Everything else we can sell to NPC. There's also, there's meta events that happen in some maps that aren't even listed on the, uh, on the, on the wiki. As I found out. <laughs> Ooh, we're not gonna go do that. 
Ooh, but Jakar is coming up. So, It's not right. Something's not measured right. That would explain it. So it didn't compensate for that gap I have from the between the desk over there and the wall over there. So this is two. That's this. Got in here. So that's one eighty five. Oh, it's way off. Okay. It's one hundred and eighty five centimeters. All right, so. So you erase these. So one eighty five minus forty is one forty five. It's a little long, okay. It's gonna be sixty centimeters. And then this would be No, that's not adding up. So sixty centimeters. Okay, so one hundred and twenty-five. Not measuring this way. Yeah. 
Okay, so... Somehow, somewhere, five centimeters appeared. <laughs> like, five extra centimeters. No. Actually, yes. You know. Yeah. The one that we've been getting. Maybe? I'll come back maybe then. Ooh. That's fine. I'm just doing some metas and doing some calculations. How dare you, human! Turtle ice over here.
Ba-dum. 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 Nyam, 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 nyam. Oh shit. Oh, I saw that coming. A lot of food that people just keep dropping. Oh, that's um... Grab the banner! Ah! <laughs> no! I refuse to go! Come on! Oh, I made it. Oh, no, you don't.
Do they still have it so that you can't go into it again? Squish. Which way it's gonna be this time? I wonder if you can go through again? Nope. Messer portal isn't working either. So okay, like an hour and 15 before that convergence thing is again. Oh! Let's get that health back a little bit.
Mm. And done. Big chests. I'm missing one? Pretty sure I have. Um. Oh, wait, no. I don't think you can actually go to any of these. Yeah, no. I think that was just during the thing. That's where you come out of, yeah. Dirt. Oh my god. Yeah. Yeah. Size yeah. All right. That's the same goddamn price too. Yeah, it is. Yeah. It's the same as four. No. Yeah. Oh, that's good. No. Yes. Yeah. We have bread to go with our chili con carne. Be done in like 30 minutes. Mm. Let's just. Chili con carne is something that I highly recommend that you make with the crock pots, by the way. Everything just gets so tender and... Mm, just so good. So, so good. Some type of solo cooking utensil. It doesn't have to be like an actual thing called a crock pot, but no, <clears throat> that's pretty good. All I have to do is just make sure every few hours you go to stir it. Make sure nothing's burning or sticking. See the tip of Kita's tail right around the edge over here. It's like, what is that moving? Let's see here. You know what we haven't done? We actually haven't done anything with Papa Fire in a long time on stream.
I have officially 1500 eternal ice shards. Holy crap. <laughs> okay. I dig it, I dig it, I go for it. So we got the powders down here. Nice, good selection, kitty. salvage some of this stuff because I think that's what we have to do right that's one of the things oh yeah we should probably salvage some of this yeah now we got um we got some some ground beef tomato onion cut like two thirds of a chili serrano and beans I'm doing black beans this time As they continue to yap. Do this one it's augury rock the path of ascension yep okay going that way I see flex. Let's go, go, go. I mean, the Grawl were fucking attracted to the Augury Rock too in the first game. I think everything is just attracted to it because it's massive. Speaking of massive, started watching Reacher. That dude is huge. Wow, holy shit. Only thing that went through my mind was like, he must work out. <laughs> Honestly though, I'm actually enjoying it. We've only got through two episodes before we had to go and like break and do IRL well I mean that's still IRL, like chores and activities, various activities. But overall 
I'm liking it a lot. Portal. Cluster of desert herbs. What does this one give us? Coriander seeds and a dust. Well, that's from the glyph, but. I don't think we really have a choice. I mean, even if we went through this, they would be attacking us. Attacking us, not attacking us. Step at the bird. Kind of a fucked up bird, but still. That's done. Come on. Jesus Christ, I think she's broken. Okay, that took some time.
not to say, I think there's like little choyas that pop up here. Ooh, ancient sapling. Well then don't fucking fall, jeez. Dude, today I had one of the most juicy mandarins, or mandarina, that I have had in a long time. It's actually really, really nice. some lentils. Go back here. Go pew 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 pew. Angry Choya. Let the heat come up. That's a good one. It's not a good one? It was bad? Oh, don't tell me it's dry. Oh, soak it in water. Yeah, soak in water and it'll get. Oh wow, that's a lot. Holy shit. Okay. Those were actually pretty tasty.
He didn't like that though. She ate some. She ate too? Oh, yeah. oh man, that dog will eat anything though. Uh oh, there's a veteran version of me here. Oh no. Kill the imposter! Six. Stop spotting these things. Just let us kill you. Take it with dignity. Serious again? People who got up behind over here are now down. Oh, come on, three, two, one, dead. Let's go. Woo! Say hi to some ghosts. Hello, ghosts. How are you doing, ghosts? I don't remember if there's anything past this or not. I don't think so. I think that was it.
Yeah, I'm pretty sure that was it. Do I have this done? Hold on. I think I do. Just making sure. Yeah. It's really gotta like go in and have to do these things in order. I'm pretty sure I have all of this done. I didn't see it, I think I already gotten it, so. Cave Screamer. Where is that one? No, no. the last one. Oh. Yeah, no, hold on. Okay. Making sure. Okay. <clears throat> the doppelganger is going to pop soon. Um, defensive Omnitas is going to pop. Actually, I kind of want to do that. Uh, copy. Mostly because I still need to earn some stuff. 
to any of those guys too. Just earlier today, and that feels like I have nipples. Oh This I still need to make a guide for, for the meta. Although this one is really easy to figure out. This hasn't popped yet. What the hell? Apparently there's a lot of people who are upset with the rewards that you get from opening those chests. Like the amount of work that you had to do in order to dump into it. Like that's what I've been looking at for like people in map chat and stuff. Why? I don't know. Like I get it, but at the same time it's I I, I don't know. That one, open these, open that. I thought it was good too, but like the amount of complaints that I have seen, I'm like, yeah, like I just, I don't get it. I just, I don't know why. <laughs> I mean, especially since it's, um, that's a word, right? Or maybe it's not, no. Um, Oh, it's this one. Um, the Heart of the Obscure Research. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I'm gonna be honest. Flight training, first and foremost, get that as your main priority for this. It's gonna make navigating tons better. When it comes to Heart of the Obscure, Updraft, Generator, that was pretty much like, I would say get get these first two. After that, it's more of like, oh, these are nice, especially the Leyloom Operation. Yeah, that one, this one's something else, but um, yeah, I think between these two things, Flight Training, hands down, the first and foremost thing that you should definitely pay attention to, but dumping... Dumping your uh, mastery points into these things, it's not bad. I mean, as I have 
just you know, gotten to the point of st uh, tired of just playing the RNG game that whatever these things give me. I, mean, I just end up selling these. I'd rather just buy the things that I need. And that's actually what I ended up doing over the weekend was um getting stuff. That's how I got my second piece of legendary armor finally done. I had to buy some tier 6 materials. But I mean, with these things, you honestly you could make a decent amount of money, even with the with the rares and the other ones, like twenty silver. Honestly, that stuff stacks up pretty quickly. Just instant sell. Like, there's no point in. I mean, for this, I'm not even gonna list it. Just instant sell. Seriously. Tempted to sell these, but. See if there is Oh yeah. Here we go. ISO is in Blaze Ridge Steps. No. ISO is my bad is in the internal battlegrounds. Jeff number five is in Blaze Ridge Steps. Reading is hard at times. <laughs> This is Amitaz. Nobody is starting up a group for this. I guess no. It's a lot of people that are in EV, EVG. Looks like we might have a broken meta.
is down below, I think. Yep. Someone was over here earlier and just popped a bunch of these things. Holy shit. Oh, I can't get away. I cannot get away. Oh my god. Holy shit. Holy crap, they're chasing. Oh my god, they're chasing. Oh, we got people. Okay. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, 
Come on, rise! After this, we're gonna go do the convergences again and then get that done for the wizard's vault. Last one. Oh, you can't just right click these away? Right. It's kind of lame. Hmm. Someone's got that that sky skill skin, the new one. You don't know. Come on, come on.
It's really weird that the main map had like nobody on it. Well, it did, but not like no. The event didn't pop, the meta did not start at all. Something I'm missing, I don't remember. Let me get this guy up. Oh, I ran out of charges. Just in case they don't know, I just got that same leap platform. Somebody was asking about things. Stab it with the sword. Stab, 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 stab. Losing rift. Ah, they got it up top. There's not another champion, right?
Let's go steal launcher. Tree. I don't have enough space to mount. Are you kidding me? You need to put more up into the air if you want people to collect more in BC. Let's go, come on. weird that I can't so this is left click and then you do a right click and that's supposed to do that <laughs> Demon orbs. Demon orbs of doom. this thing in its face. Look at the Tifums. Strange. Do the yoga poses. So usually a lot of people end up just opening up their boxes while this goes on. I know, right? The fact that they don't even ch like change it up—it's literally six, seven, eight, nine, zero. Yep. 
back to six. Six, seven, eight, nine, zero, six, seven, eight, nine, zero. Which are we gonna poke out this time? I have regrets, okay? I have malice. Oh, I got that one in my sights. I'm hitting that one. We've got enough time to get to convergences. That took way too long, though. People to troll. Not like the hair. Anyway, mm -hmm. come on, come on, come on, come on, mode. I think I was there for too long. See if we can get this done. Now that I know what I'm doing. Back to that. 
Still waiting. Um, Sky Forged H. Just missing the hammer. Got that done. Somebody dropped a frost bow back there. Virgin's Creature Crusher. Crush them. Step on them. Squish them. Give them a big old hug. Champion Avatar of Regret. Go, go, run, run, run! They hit that one pretty well. Let's get to this one again. Yeah, 
just um, deep attack mighty. I don't know why they focus that one instead of the other one first. Gracias, gracias. No, wait, no, they're over here. No, oh, where is everybody for this? We don't have a commander tag up, that's why I'm wondering like where the hell is everybody? Okay, we've got some over here. So that's how this- okay, I'm, I got it. I got it. Each area has lieutenants. It looks like that one over there has five. So in order to clear out the, the zone, you need to defeat all of the lieutenants. So it's going to be the second one here. Sounds like this is a clusterfuck of a map instance right now. Everybody's zerging on top of Zoja and not uh, doing other stuff.
Oh, this is bad. This is so bad. Grab it all, grab it all, grab it all, grab it all. Okay, maybe we weren't working the last one for Northeast. I thought we were. Wait, do these things respawn? Interesting. Oops, there's a button.
Come on, land. There we go. Push it. I think they have a boss that revives after X amount of time. I'm not sure. Because this one is at one and we just got done taking it down and now we have another one. That's not exactly the. Oh my god. Okay, yeah, so. Oh, there's a boss after you kill the five. Okay, that's what I was wondering. That's why I'm like. Because we killed the five, and then there's another one that shows up. It's like, where is this extra one coming from? No, but somebody, somebody explained. Like this one, right? This is the last one here. There's none other ones here. After we kill this one, there's gonna be another one that pops. Or maybe that was the last one. I don't know. Either way, I was very confused. Oh, that's a face. Holy shit, there's faces everywhere. Somebody's watching. <laughs> yeah, no, that's what I was like. Mm. Because on the, over here, it says like there's five bosses, right? And then it's like, and you see there's one left and then you do that and then there's another one that appears and it's like you just got done taking down the fifth boss. Where's, 
where is this extra one coming from? I was just <laughs> I was like maybe maybe my brain is playing tricks on me and maybe we're only downing a four even though it says five and the little things on the on the map are five and now there's zero and then we get the extra one like up around. This one in here. Wee woo! Whoa! Whoa! Shit! It's rain. It's rainy meteors. It is rainy meteors. Oh dear God! Oh my God, Becky! ran right into that. Nope. Not today. Not today. Run. 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 Corey, 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 corey. Apparently there's different types of bosses. Apparently this is the easy boss. Take that. There we go. <laughs> this is the same one that I had last time. The Demon Knight. Unless they're all called demon knights, and I just don't know. Oh, jeez, that was... That was all my... That was my part.
No! Oh god, it's taking me somewhere I don't want to go. One of them is me? No, not me. No, it's not come. Take this, you do this. Death from above! Pew, pew, pew. Shit, was there a meteor that I just totally missed out on? What? Did I just murder everybody? Probably. Probably me. What, you're no longer in your PC, kitty? Ooh, don't go that way. There's targets over there. Why is this like really weird blue? You see this? Has it always been like that? Your butt was falling asleep. You got butt problems? <laughs> Happy looting? Wait, there's there's loot in here? Oh yeah, no, just, yeah, that's kind of weird. Two hundred percent participation. Yeah. That's why you're supposed to shift around, kitty, like this. Take frequent bathroom breaks, get drinks, stretch. Even the dog does all of that. See what we got. Lots of that. There you go. Yeah, let's go get yourself a control. I mean, I know you have one. And then just, you know, like, throw whenever you get mad. It's like playing fetch with yourself. this thing. Ouch. 
Alright, let's sell these things. I mean, I don't know if other people do this, but apparently, subconsciously, I enjoy playing hide and seek with myself. When, like, I misplace things, and then I'm like, crap, where did I put it? And then you're like, mmm. It's so annoying. It is so annoying. You should eat. Also, I should eat. And also, it is that time. Alright, boys and girls and everything that's in between. That is it for me this evening. Um, make sure that we're going to... I'm joining the after stream party in Discord right after this. Um, that is a very sad treasure hunt. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Um, I'm going to have that video done this weekend. I don't know if I'm actually going to get it done tomorrow. I'm going to try. But I don't know if I'll actually succeed for the Verdant Brain Kits are going to be my news, one of my two new series for YouTube. In total, there's going to be three. There's the Guilders, not the Guilders, the Warframe missions in five minutes or less. That's restarting, kicked off last week. This week it's going to be the Guilders 2 How to Meta within the map, working off of the guides that I've already written. And then we've got, it's not called Alzheimer's. Um, and then I've got. Meet the Warframes, and that's going to be next week, or I might have to skip next week and put that for the week after because there's nothing after that one. Um, yeah, I'm working on a guide for Dragonfall, this map. This will be my next written guide. Um, and then I think the one after that is... I think it's one of these. I'm about to check. I haven't looked at it yet. Um, but yeah. So there's that. Um, remember for those of you... Wow, my voice is cracked. For those of you who do participate in our Arma nights, Arma is tomorrow night since we did Pathfinder last week. So we've got Arma tomorrow. Um, also possibly Sunday. I do have the whole map opened. They don't have everything done giddy like this there's nothing that you can access here they got like a big zone right there like this is factions they they haven't given us anything else like this is the old kining like the one that you remember and i remember like a lot of people from the og game remember you can't access it which really kind of ir irked me because I'm like, I wanted to go see. I wanted to see what it looked like to have after all of these years and then we just get drowned kining. Yeah, no. I mean, I'm assuming that we're going to get some of these things elsewhere. I mean... Anyway. So yeah, gonna be doing that. So I know that I've got a pretty busy weekend. I'm looking forward to it. And for those of you who play Arma 3, see you guys tomorrow. After stream party is starting now. See you guys there. Bye! That's it, man. Game over, man. It's game over! <laughs>